do, do, do. This will be the Easter gift right here. Uh, oh, oh, shit. Okay. Wait. You're not the Easter Bunny. Oh, yes, I am, Kevin. You, can you see my sexy ears? Get out! Uh, okay, okay. You, you imposter, I'm gonna call the police on you if you come back. Okay. Ah. Stupid. Anyways. Oh, hello, everybody. This is Skeleton. Zombie. Luigi and Pig. And Chucky. Let's bring Chucky out. There he is. And... As you can tell, this is obviously an Easter special. And what is for the first time ever, hopefully a YouTube premiere. So any so yeah, uh basically um I was bored. I was thinking of what video I should do for Easter. Uh Besides character watches the logo Easter special, but I figure why not start a new series? It's not gonna be a DVD opening. Well, it's DVD related. I would figured why not check out some DVDs that have interactual DVD ROM contents. Yeah, interactual player. That one piece of software popularity to have DVD ROM stuff. Yeah. Ooh, intellectual. I love I love interactual so much. Okay, Luigi. Yeah. Anyways, here's the cameraman. I the cameraman's also here. He can see his hand. We're we we've got a DVD. We're gonna see if we can show the DVD ROM features on. Yeah. And obviously we're using a Windows XP virtual machine on a Mac. This is the only computer that Austin has with a... This is actually the only computer Austin has with the DVD drive now. But who cares? As long as it, as long as it works. So anyways, the duty we've got to show for the DVD ROM features for this first episode. And it's going to be browsing through to see if, if there are any good interactual stuff. Hopefully... So one of these will actually have a video game on there because I heard that some interactual features actually have PC video game demos for your PC. Like for example, there's a video on YouTube where actually there was a there was a guy who was game playing the Spider-Man DVD from Interactual, and it had a Spider-Man demo game from Activision. So let's hope this one has some stuff. So we got for this video we got Austin Powers the Spy Who Shagged Me. This is Awesome Powers 2, by the way. AKA Awesome Powers 2, I should say. And it's got Mike Myers and Heather Graham. Put the W there and you got Weather Graham. I don't know if that makes sense. This is a New Line Platinum DVD, but it's from, but it's actually from Alliance Atlantis. But it doesn't matter. Because the original one probably, ha I guarantee, has this stuff as well. Here's the spine, everything. You got the Scary Alliance DVD logo. And the back. This is from 2002, and here are the features right here. If you want to read them, pause. We're not going to make this too long a video, because of the space on my phone. Yeah. So, cameraman, will you pop it in? Yes, sir. Here is the DVD. This is... And yes, this is a DVD camera I got from his DVD lot back in March. Let's put it in. Alright, let's see what DVD content we're gonna get. DVD ROM content we're gonna get. And we're using a Windows Virtual Machine because... Chances are good. A majority of interactual features will not work on a Mac. Oh, look at that. PC-friendly installation. This DVD contains a special feature... So we can design for a PC. Would you like to install and run these features now? Yes, I would. Install. Come on, install. We got interactual working. I mean, let's turn the volume on. I apologize if the volume is turned off. So. Come on, interactual. Come on, interactual. We want some DVD games from the Awesome Powers DVD ROM. Oh, look. It's here. 
the spy who shied me. DVD ROM. Yeah. I was just waiting for it to load up. And by the way, we won't be using every DVD that has interactual features on it just because this Mac is complete garbage when it comes to reading some DVDs. Like, one, a lot of times on one disc when it tries to read, it just ejects. Like, it, it, it attempts to read like three times. After those three fail, it ejects. On some of them, at first it might do that, but if you put it back, it might work, but yeah. Otherwise, it's just screwed up. This program installs the software for your PC friendly so you can watch TV quality on your, on your computer. Hooray! Oh, here's the awesome powers menu. Welcome to the DVD. It looks like we're installing an awesome powers game, kind of. I'm installing. Acromedia Flash Player. And this may end up going into two parts. So, you know what? Uh, oh, oh. I don't know, would you like to get rid of this feature? Yeah, we're probably going to jump cut. Probably. Oh. Next. We cannot find a modem network. So who cares? We're on PC friendly now. We're gonna try to be as quickly as we can. If this takes too long, we'll jump cut because you know a little storage on my phone. Oh look, you look at this. Here it is, the DVD day. It has a operation trivia and actually a link to the IMDB website. Interactive awesome operation trivia. This, this, is, this is the computer game You can see right there Click here To install it Or you can actually install the game You might or may not make this into a premiere if this goes into two parts Just cuz well, but we do want to premiere this Please go to control panel to install the configure the products. Okay, you know what? We're gonna jump cut. Let's let's just go ahead and do it. Okay, you know what? We don't know what it's talking about when it says go to control panel configure. So if anybody knows why it's telling me that, you better let me know in the comments if you understand this, that message. But anyways, interactive Austin instead. Hopefully it doesn't tell us to do anything bad. Welcome. You see the new line logo right there. It's Do you wish to install this application? As long as it doesn't tell me to go to the control panel, yes. As long as it doesn't tell me to go to the control panel again. You wish to install this application. Okay, what what, what are you doing? What are you doing? That is just weird. I, I, I now this is supposed to be screensavers probably. Let's see what about the screensavers. What about the screensavers? I don't know. Starfield? <laughs> Where do you download the screensavers? Hey, menu. Uh, cast and crew. Where's your website? We're probably not gonna check. Play movie. This might actually play the OS last level. Let's see. Uh, DVD decoder actually, so you can't. Wah, wah, wah. Well, why do you want me to go to control panel mode DVD to install that game? Yeah, this is kind of like a scam. This is kind of what I was doing off camera. Uh, let's see what I'm doing. Can it launch with a newer interactional though? We have a newer interactional player. Oh, again. So now we have PC friendly on the desktop. Well, I'm just gonna ask us that again. 
is going to control panel. I don't know why. We'll try it on a newer version of Windows, maybe. What do you think? Let's try it on a newer version of Windows off camera. Let's see what we think. Okay, you know what, guys? I think we're going to stop here. I've been trying to do some off camera shit, but a lot of it is probably going to take a while. So, but I do want to say this. Bill Gates, what the heck is wrong with you? I should be able to access the PC friendly stuff no matter what. But I can't because I have to go to control panel to do what exactly? What exactly? Frick you, Bill Gates. Anyways, whatever. That That's still the PC-friendly episode. If anybody knows why that's happening, you better please tell me. Otherwise, we'll explode. Yeah, and, uh... We were gonna install maybe Windows 95 in a virtual machine, but I'm actually afraid to because of an error message that comes up whenever I try to do it. And I don't feel like doing it in 16 color mode. It's probably not gonna work anyway. I'm not sure if it would... I, 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 I have higher doubts that it would come up on, like, on XP with the control panel thing, but if it does, I'm gonna lose it. We're all gonna lose it. But anyways... Yeah, sorry if this was too short. Especially for Martin Gomez, but at least we made it into a premiere for the first time. Hopefully. And, yeah. Also, my mom, I think, is making dinner, so that's why I'm ending it here. Happy Easter, everyone, and see ya. This has been the first episode of Doing Interaction. See you all in the next video. Take care. Bye, everyone.